Okay, this is kind of a random vlog, and it's about games. Yes, it is. I'm Chris Jones, in case you didn't know that, but you do know that because this is my channel you're listening to. It on. Anyway, um, the idea about this is gaming versus real life. It's an ongoing controversy, or an ongoing discussion. Sometimes it can be a controversy when the gaming that you do on your computer or your Xbox 360 or your PlayStation 3 or your Nintendo basically takes over your life or can have a tendency to basically be all that you do or all that you think about. In the case of MMOs and fantasy games like World of Warcraft and maybe Star Trek Online and any of those online games uh, that just have a persistent universe that they go on forever. I mean, you, you t your mind tends to get in there and it says, I gotta do this and this, I got this quest, I gotta go do this, I gotta go do that. And pretty soon, nine or ten hours goes by. What did I do today? Oh, yeah. I played games all day. Did I get anything done? No. Did I have to get something done? Maybe. Maybe not. Should I have been doing something? No. Yes. Who knows? That just goes on and on forever. And pers sometimes it can ruin marriages, it can wreck your relationships. Now, if you don't have a relationship, if you're single and you're a gamer, well, fine. I mean, life is good, I guess. Although I can't imagine just playing games for a living and not having, you know, a, a relationship or any kind of life outside the game. That would be rather boring, very honestly. So you have to kind of balance it. It has to be a balance. A balance of gaming and life and stuff and obligations. If you can find a nice balance in there, a lot of people do, uh, then you'll be fine. But if you let it get to you, if, you, if you're in World of Warcraft all the time, or if you're in any MMO, EverQuest, there's a lot of them. I can't even, there's just so many I can't say them all. Battlestar Galactica Online, now that's a good one actually. Star Trek Online, I keep mentioning that. And I don't play that. People think I should. I've been asked. I said, I just don't want to play any MMOs. Only because, oh, let's go do this. Let's go do that. Let's go do this. Let's go do that. Um, I guess I just don't feel I have the time to do it. Part of it is like, well, okay. Um, I'm playing this game for four hours. Should I be doing something else more productive? Some people may not have anything to do. They may have all their obligations and things taken care of. Some people are at a different stage a different part of their life. In the case of, I guess I'd be one of those older gamers. You know. I run a gaming site, ChrisJonesGaming.net. That doesn't mean I'm necessarily a hardcore gamer. I like hearing about it, like reporting on it, like listening to the games, discussions on podcasts and videos and stuff. Not necessarily playing everything. So, just strike a balance. Okay? A balance between real life obligations, relationships, and gaming. And if you can do that, you, you got it going. Okay? It's a rainy day. It's May 15th. This is the day that Diablo 3 gets released. It's, they're having lots of streams online. Major League Gaming. I think they're based in New York. They're having a bunch of streams on it today. People playing live and stuff. Max Payne 3. Sonic the Hedgehog 4 Episode 2. Uh, what else? Game of Thrones and some others I can't recall right at this moment. So it's kind of a big gaming day today. Have fun. Strike a balance. And live life. Bye.